Hi, I want to briefly talk about how to manipulate mass parameter in TP. Let's say we have the scene that contain five identical bottle shapes. The scene setup is look like this. We have object to particle node. We have a gravity with mass exposed and multiplied by float value. And we have shape collision node with box added as the floor node. If you want to make them from different materials, the first step is assign the mass to user node properties of original objects. Let's hide TP system, show original objects. The quick way is use a simple script. What script does is calculate mass of object and multiply it by density of materials that you want to use. Let's see first wood, second plastic, glass, aluminum and steel. Let's check it. The next step is told TP that we want to assign mass to particles from user properties. This can be done with custom scripted node. Let's look the code. So we have two inputs par particle and node. Then we read the value from the first input, then from the second input get user properties with name of mass from the node and assigned this mass to particles. Okay. Ok, so now you can see the difference. The FO depends on mass. The next thing we can do is make some trigger action depends on object type. This can be done again with custom node. Let's say we have this node. It has two inputs, particle and node, one output particle. We read, we read first input from node, then second, then put in variable user properties of node, and then compare with the list box presented in node. If they equal, then we send particle ID. Ok, so here list box with materials, we, then we put output to the memory operator. And then we put it to the volume breaker. And volume breaker is turned on when the particle collided with ground. Ok, let's choose different types. Steel, wood, 